New tonight, we are learning a seven-year-old girl has died after drowning this afternoon. She is the third person to drown in a Minnesota lake this weekend. Hennepin County Sheriff's deputies, Bloomington police, and firefighters arrived at East Bush Lake Beach around 4 o'clock. Emergency responders attempted to resuscitate the girl who later died at Minneapolis Children's Hospital. A man who was at the beach with his family described what he saw. He turned around and... A lifeguard was uh, carrying a girl across the threshold uh, uh, from the water to the grass. Ed Beckman says he watched as five lifeguards helped administer CPR. The Hennepin County Sheriff's Office is investigating, and the county coroner hasn't yet released the girl's name. Meantime, Hennepin County deputies say a woman died due to a medical emergency on Long Lake around 7 o'clock last night. And just a few miles away, another woman, identified by family as Nataya Kadundi, drowned on Lake Minnetonka. Kate Raditz explains how a day meant for celebration for Nataya's family turned into tragedy. Family and friends of Nataya, who went missing on Lake Minnetonka Saturday night, gathered near Maxwell Bay Launch as authorities searched for the 36-year-old. Around 1.30 a.m. Sunday, a dive team pulled her body from Crystal Bay. A family member told WCCO the woman had been celebrating her birthday along with nearly a dozen people on a pontoon, but there were either no life jackets or not enough. It's, it's just a good reminder for everybody to try to avoid these tragic weekends like we've had this weekend. Lieutenant Steve Labette with the Hennepin County Sheriff's Office says the deadly weekend on the water is a reminder of how quickly drownings can happen. Drownings are, are a silent death. Um, Contrary to what many people feel, that there's a lot of noise and, and uh, uh, attention being drawn. Uh, drownings, when they occur, they're, they're, they're underwater, they're, they're silent. In Minnesota, boaters are required to have a life jacket for each person on board. Children under the age of 10 have to wear a life jacket at all times. It's unclear if Nataya was wearing a life jacket or if she had been drinking before she drowned. Remain vigilant, uh, looking out for one another, and, uh, and have a safe experience on the water. Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. According to the Hennepin County Sheriff's Department, there were six deaths in Minnesota lakes last year.